We don't know the gender of baby number two. We've decided to wait until 20 weeks to find out, which is getting close. I really like doing it this way. First of all, it's a good motivator. For me, at this point in the pregnancy is when the excitement of the positive test kind of starts to wear off, but the birth still feels so far away. So this new reveal gets me excited all over again. I feel ready to take on 20 more weeks. Plus, it makes me feel even closer to my growing little baby. But here's the thing. We have the ultrasound tech tell us when to close our eyes during the sonogram so we don't actually find out in the room with somebody else. We ask them to write down if it's a boy or a girl in a sealed envelope. Then when we get in the car, Matt opens the envelope and tells me if we're going to be having a son or daughter. And we have a gender reveal celebration with friends and family later on. Or at least that's what we did with our first. But I think I prefer it this way because the simplicity of finding out just the two of us feels really special. And getting to personally tell the people close to us first is nice since we live fairly public lives. And who doesn't like a good party? So we'll find out in a few weeks, but you guys probably won't know for another month or so.